Coronation Street star Liz Dawn is back at home and on the mend after being treated for life-threatening illness. Friends of the 77-year-old feared the worse after she was rushed to hospital with severe breathing problems. Coronation Street legend Liz Dawn is back at home after being discharged from hospital following life-saving treatment. The star spent more than two weeks being cared for by doctors when she developed severe breathing problems. Friends and family of the 77-year-old, who played Fiera Duckworth for 34 years, were left fearing the worse. But she fought back and was discharged on Friday evening. Yesterday she was being cared for by relatives. Husband Don Ibbotson said, We're so relieved to have her back home. At one point she took very bad and we thought the worst but she fought back, it's amazing and now she seems to be getting stronger by the day. Liz, a former heavy smoker, has suffered from the lung condition emphysema for several years. She had a pacemaker fitted in 2013 after having a heart attack while on holiday in Spain. In June she had surgery linked to her heart condition but she fell ill again and was taken to Widenshea Hospital, Greater Manchester in late August. Her family kept a constant vigil by her bedside. Liz's mood was also boosted by a visit from her recently born great-grandson, the son of grandson Luke Hibbertson and his wife Nicola. She was also cheered by messages of support from fellow Koi stars including Alan Halsall and Samia Gady, who played Tyrone Dobbs and Maria Sutherland in the ITV soap. A family source said, she is still very poorly but she's fighting all the way and it is better for her to be here in her own place, her own environment and amongst her family where she feels more comfortable. Liz first appeared on The Cobbles in 1974, quickly becoming a viewer favorite alongside on-screen husband Jack, played by Bill Tarmy. She left in 2008 but made one last appearance in 2010 when her ghost visited Jack before he passed away. Bill died of a heart attack, aged 71, at his holiday home in Tenerife two years later. Speaking recently about her health problems, Liz said, If it wasn't for the doctors, I wouldn't be here today. My health is very bad these days. I just have to get on with things, with things.